ตัวนี้โอเคนะ when we have electrophilic substitution of any benzene okay if let's say this particular benzene I want to actually react with Br2 okay what I need I need a catalyst so the catalyst is FBr3 FeBr3 so what happens is when the Br okay they come close to FeBr3 FeBr3 will polarize okay the Br2 where the electron will move towards one side delta negative and delta positive and those delta negative they will move towards FeBr3 forming FeBr4 okay negative plus Br plus which is going to be your electrophile so what happens over here is when this electrophile when they approach the benzene okay what happens is they are going to be attracted towards the high density of electrons in the delocalized uh, ring so that electron will tend to actually move over there okay that's going to be the way we show the arrow the curly arrow should be from uh, to show the movement of the electrons So what happens is you are going to have an intermediate, okay? Intermediate where there is H, okay? Earlier they didn't show the H, but it's there. There is H, and then there is going to be a bond between Br, and then now, okay, the electrons ring is not completed, so it's going to be something like this. So what happens? This is not stable, okay? You need to actually make it stable. The electrons from this bond they will actually come back. Okay, they will come back to here again. So what happens is you are going to have a bromo benzene. Okay, so Br over there. So the H plus that is given out. Okay, the H plus that is given out. They are going to react with FeBr4. Okay, which is going to They are going to give you FeBr3 again plus HBr. So this is what is going to happen. Okay. So this entire thing is known as electrophilic because we are dealing with electrophile. Okay, something that loves electron and substitution. Why? We call this as substitution because you are trying to substitute this hydrogen from the benzene to become Br. So it means from C six H six, you are going to get C six H five Br. You have managed to substitute the hydrogen with Br. So therefore, it's called electrophilic substitution. Okay. So that is going to be.